Yo, what's going on guys? It is time for another reaction video. And this time I'm be reacting to something new. Uh, somebody in the comments on one of the last Terry Mack videos I did or recent ones uh, suggested that I check out Ren. So I went and looked up Ren on YouTube and I uh, found a song called Hi Ren and it had the most views. So this person looks like their YouTube goes back about four years, but this song looks to be the most popular. Uh, so I'm going to start with this one. I did watch about the first five or seven seconds uh, when I first went to find the channel. Um, and it looks like it's going to be interesting, but I didn't want to ruin the experience. I wanted to save it for, for first time reactions. So let's get into this. Already, this looks like a setting out of some of my photo shoots I've, I've done in the past. If you guys don't know, I am a photographer. Go check out my work, mmpstudios.com. Uh, I did a whole series of photos with masks, and I have a pig mask that's very similar to that one. <laughs> to a good start man I mean the, the guitar alone is impressive expecting that at all but it I like it hi there Ran it's been a little while did you miss me you thought you buried me didn't you risky cuz I always come back deep down you know that deep down you know my mom is in periphery Ran on your pleased to see me it's been weeks since we spoke bro I know you need me you're the sheep I'm the shepherd not your place to lead me not your place to be biting off the hand that feeds me hi Ran I've been taking some time to be distant I've been taking some time to be still I've been taking some time to be by myself Since my therapist told me I'm ill And I've been making some progress lately And I've learned some new coping skills So I haven't really needed you much man I think we need to just step back and chill Ren, you sound more insane than I do You think that those doctors are really there to guide you You've been through this a million times Your civilian mind is so perfect to always be lied to Okay, take another pill boy Drown yourself in the sound of white noise Follow this 10 step program Rejoice, all your problems will be gone Fucking dumb boy Nah mate, this time is different man, trust me I feel like things might be falling in place And my music's been kinda doing bits too Like I actually might do something great And when I'm gone, maybe I'll be remembered for doing something special with myself That's why I don't think that we should talk man Cause when you're with me it never seems to help You think that you can amputate me I am you, you are me, you are I, I am we We are one, split in two, that makes one So you see, you gotta kill you if you wanna kill me I'm not left over dinner, I'm not scraps on the Man this is I don't really know what I was expecting Cause I, I had no clue what to expect But this is Interesting, I mean it's like I'm trying to place the accent. I don't know if it's British or Irish or even Scottish, but I'm leaning towards Irish right now, um, which obviously I could be wrong. Um, the back and forth with the different personalities, it somewhat reminds me of a track that Eminem did. I can't think of which one it is right now. And I'm not saying that this guy is imitating or trying to be Eminem, because I know that quite often people will just, uh, their first go-to to, co to compare somebody to is like Eminem. But, um, it's, it's kind of how he's going back and forth in different personalities. It's making me think of that track, but I can't even think of which one it is. Uh, but yeah, I'm digging this so far. I'm going to roll it back just a little bit. I like the setting of it. I like the sound of it. I like the fact that he's playing guitar. And I don't even know if you would really, this is sort of rap, but it's more like spoken rap. Um, if that makes sense, he's not, he's, he 
he started in the beginning kind of singing or harmonizing um but now he's doing more of a kind of like a talk rap type thing i don't know i dig it though it's cool that makes one so you see you gotta kill you if you wanna kill me i'm not left over dinner i'm not scraps on the side oh your music is thriving delusional guy where's your top 10 hit where's your interview with oprah where well, are your grammys ren Nowhere. Yeah, but my music's not commercial like that. I never chase numbers, statistics, or stats. I never write hooks for the radio, they never even play me, so why would I concern myself with that? But my music is really connecting, and the people who find it respect it. And for me, that's enough, cause this life's been tough, so it gives me a purpose I can rest in. Man, you sound so pretentious. Ren, your music is so self centered. No one wants to hear another song about how much you hate yourself. Trust me. You should be so lucky Having me inside you to guide you, remind you To manage expectations, provide you perspective That thing you neglect it, I get it You wanna be a big deal, next Jimi Hendrix, forget it Man, it's not like that Man, it's just like that, I'm inside you, you twat No, it's not, man, you're wrong, when I write, I belong Let me break the fourth wall by acknowledging this song Ren sits down, has a stroke of genius He wants to write a song that was not done previous A battle with his subconscious, Eminem did it Played on guitar, Plan B did it I knew I heard it was, there was a reference for Eminem um, what I like about this so far, I'm not a musician, but I'm a content creator, right? And I think at some point you, you always get inside your own head, right? You're like, why am I doing this? Uh, am I going to be successful at this? Am I getting the views I'm expecting for the, the effort I'm putting in? Um, is this all going to pay off in the end? You know, like you kind of constantly question yourself, you know, am I going the right direction with my YouTube channel? Am I putting out content that people are going to enjoy to consume as much as I enjoy to create? And that's kind of like him describing his journey with music. It sounds like so far is um, one side of him doubting himself. The other side's like, no, we got our own thing here. That, that's my take so far. Not done previous, a battle with the subconscious, Eminem did it Played on guitar, Plan B did it Man, you're not original, you criminal, rip off artist The pinnacle of your success is stealing other people's material Ren, mate, we've heard it all before Oh, uh, she sells seashells on the seashore Fuck you, I don't need you, I don't need to hear this Cause I'm fine by myself, I'm a genius And I will be great, and I will make waves And I'll shake up the whole world beneath us That's right, speak your truth, your fucking god complex leaks out of you It's refreshing to ask for you, say it, instead of downplay it uh, music is all about the creative process And if people can find something to relate to within that Then that's just a bonus Fuck you, I'ma fucking kill you, Ren Well, fucking kill me then, let's fucking have you, Ren I'ma do it, watch me prove it Who are you to doubt my music? Cause I call the shots, I choose if you die Yeah, I call the shots and so I choose who survives I'll tie you up in knots when I lock you inside <sighs> Newsflash I was created at the dawn of creation I am temptation I am the snake in Eden. I am the reason for treason. Beheading all kings. I am sin with no rhyme or reason. Son of the morning, Lucifer, Antichrist, father of lies. Mustopheles, truth in a blender, deceitful pretender, the banished avenger, the righteous surrender. When standing in front of my solar eclipse, my name is stitched to your lips. So you see, I won't bow to the will of a mortal. Feeble and normal, you wanna kill me? I'm eternal and mortal. I live in every decision that Lies chaos that causes division I live inside death, the beginning of ends I am you, you are me, I am you, friend Man, this is intense Like, I wonder His creative process, right? Like, does he kind of just start writing the lyrics? Um and then how does he remember all of this? You know, like I do a lot of Harry Mack reactions. And one of the things that's unique about Harry is that he's able to do things on the spot. But then he has that advantage that he doesn't have to memorize a song when he wants to perform it. Um, and this is looking like it's a nine minute, 20 minute, nine minute, 20 second song. I'm five minutes, eight seconds in. And just memorizing this alone to perform it. That's that's one task in and of its own. But then the personality is going back and forth, right? And then the guitar as well. Like, I don't really know where I'm going with this. I'm just trying to think in my head how this creative process works <clears throat> to piece together a song like this. Taken 
some time to be distant. I've been taking some time to be still. I've been taking some time to be by myself and I've spent half my life ill. But just as sure as the tide starts turning, just as sure as the night has dawned, just as sure as the rain falls soon runs dry when you stand in an eye of a storm. I was made to be tested and twisted. I was made to be broken and beat. I was made by his hand, it's all part of his plan that I stand on my own two feet. And you know me, my will is eternal. And you know me, you've met me before. Face to face with a beast, I will rise from the east and I'll settle on the ocean floor. And I go by many names also. Some people know me as hope. Some people know me as the voice that you hear when you loosen the noose on the rope. And you know how I know that I'll prosper? Cause I stand here beside you today. I have stood in the flames that cremated my brain and I didn't once flinch your shame. So cower at the man I've become when I sing from the top of my lungs that I won't retire, I'll stand in your fire, inspire that me to be strong. And when I am gone, I will rise in the music that I left behind. Ferocious, persistent, a mortal like you, we're a climate different side. Man, this is amazing. Like, it's something new and it's something fresh. Like, I don't listen to a lot of radio music um, just because I, I, I find it repetitive and boring. Like, literally, like, I don't really, there's, every now and then there's some good stuff that comes out and hits on the radio, but most of the top music on the radio, um, I don't even know a lot of it these days, not like I used to, um, because I don't, I just don't enjoy it. I don't like it. it it's, it's just, uh, it's too algorithmic, right? Like they just know that they're going to get you a certain beat and it's going to hook you and they can just make the, the track exactly a certain uh, long uh, length of, of time and they know exactly when to, to raise the pitch and drop it to, to grab you. And it's just like the formula. The formula is just repetitive over and over and over. And it doesn't matter what genre you're listening to. It all just starts to sound the same. Um, there's a video I watched where somebody took like a country song, a hip hop song, a rock song, a, to a pop song, and they layered them all, kind of like when you're doing video editing, and they showed how they're all like the exact same beat, and they could raise and lower the vocals off the different songs, but the beat was kind of like the same across the board. And where I'm going with this is that, is that it all just sounds the same, right? This is like very, very, very unique and very different. Now, how many times can he replicate this before it gets uh, to be too much of the same thing? I don't know. This is my first song I'm ever hearing from him. Um, I'll likely check out some more and do some reactions to some more. But I just really like the uh, the unique uniqueness of what he's doing. I know in the beginning I said there was kind of a reference to an Eminem sound, but he's definitely, even if it does uh kind of lean to that, he's taken it and make he took it and made it his own. He completely put his own uh, style on it, and that's what what I really appreciate about it. When I was 17 years old, I shouted out into an empty room, into a blank canvas that I would defeat the forces of evil. And for the next 10 years of my life, I suffered the consequences with autoimmunity, illness, and psychosis. As I got older, I realized there were no real winners and there were no real losers in psychological warfare, but there were victims and there were students it wasn't David versus Goliath. It was a pendulum, eternally swaying from the dark to the light. And the more intensely that the light shone, the darker the shadow it cast. 
It was never really a battle for me to win. It was an eternal dance. And like a dance, the more rigid I became, the harder it got. The more I cursed my clumsy footsteps, the more I struggled. So I got older and I learned to relax. And I learned to soften and that dance got easier. It is this eternal dance that separates human beings from angels, from demons, from gods. And I must not forget, we must not forget that we are human beings. Man, that got created pretty deep at the end there. Um, I've already said a lot throughout the video, so I don't really know what more to say. Um, the way he closed the video out gives you a little bit more perspective on maybe where his mind was at when he came up with this track. Uh, it, it really makes me want to go check out more of his, his music um, and see what his journey has been like. Cause like I said, I went and looked that his, I think it goes back as about as far as four years on his YouTube channel. But, um, this one had the most views and I, I can see why this is probably the one with the most views, but now, like I said, it makes me want to go check out some of the others. So, uh, before I jump into the other, uh, songs on his channel, I want to make sure this one doesn't get a copyright strike that I can actually post it up on YouTube without any issues. Um, and that means if you guys are watching this, that it, I didn't have any issues. So y'all tell me what other ones should I look at next? Um, I, I, I mean, I, I might check out quite a few of them. I might only do a handful. I'm going to kind of lean into you guys. You tell me what uh, track from him I should check out next. Um, and tell me anything you know about him. You know, like if any of you are familiar with him, what's his story? Uh, am I right? Is he Irish? Um, how, like, I don't know, just give me, give me some background. I want to look, know a little bit more about this guy and, and his journey and, uh, what led him to where he is today. Um, since somebody did suggest this to me, uh, suggest some other, uh, artists, some other people that I can check out. One thing to keep in mind though, is if it is, um, popular music, radio music, uh, quite often I can't do that because of copyrights. So there's been a handful of times I've done reactions to stuff that was suggested. Uh, and the moment I uploaded it, um, and it got scanned, it got the copyright strike and never even got to be, be seen by you guys. So, um, it has to be stuff that's a little bit more under the radar. It can't be uh, radio play music, um, because it probably won't be able to get approved to go through on YouTube. So, um, yeah, I'm kind of rambling at this point. I really enjoyed this one. It was a nice change of pace from a lot of the stuff that I've been doing lately. Uh, yeah, y'all give me suggestions. Y'all tell me what y'all can about him. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you're not already. Click that bell so you'll get notified every time. And as I'm saying that, I am going to go subscribe right now to Rin uh, and give him a like because I really enjoyed that video. So I will see you guys in the next video. Later. <laughs>